I'm resetting my science GCSE. What the dog doing? Hacks again. Hacks again. No, you didn't. Did. Just I'm resetting my science GCSE. Whoa! I would like to see if you are still capable of answering a GCSE science question. Okay. So I will be kind as well and give you the choice of biology, chemistry, or physics. I think for me, biology, please. Okay. Biology, that's like to do with human bodies and all that, isn't it? Describe the structure of a DNA molecule. <laughs> uh, well. I know what it looks like. It's like a spirally thing with like things in the middle. Okay, and what's that called? Is, what is, this, the, is this the first question? Yeah, this is meant to be the easiest so this question. Fir the first question is which one represents DNA? I see, like, I got that right. I do know what it's called. Yeah, the middle one. I would have got that right. And then the second one is describe the structure of a DNA molecule. Is it like hex? Really? Hexagon. No. It's a double helix. Double helix. Oh, helix. So Complete the sentences. Helix the cat. A gene codes for a particular sequence of hexagon. Hexagon. Say again, can you repeat the question? A gene code for a particular sequence of... <laughs> a gene code for uh, a particular sequence of DNA. solar system. DNA. No. Chemicals. And then the next sentence is Atoms. This sequence makes a specific code. Just, just to tell the answer. A gene code for a particular sequence of amino acids. acids. Oh, this it. sequence makes a specific protein. protein. <laughs> <laughs> yes, acids. we've got to have some amino acids of protein. <laughs> Quiet please! Welcome to your biology paper one. You have approximately one hour and 15 minutes to complete. No one must leave the room till after 35 minutes. Use black ink or black ballpoint pen. Pencil should only be used for drawing. Black. Where can I get one of those from? Just for tutoring, not card at UK. Fill in the boxes at the top of this page. Answer all the questions in spaces provided. But here we are. Phew. You may begin. Excuse me, dear. I don't see the sign. It says no snacks. I was hoping there's going to be more of them. There's <laughs> <laughs> no eating here. <laughs> <laughs> what the dog doing? Mm, very good. Yeah, one in here. Somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> okay. She's got it. She's got it. 0.32. Nice. Right, finished. In. That's pretty good going, that. Pretty 30, 38 minutes and 28 seconds. And how long is paper meant to be? One hour and 15. Wow. First, biology paper one. Done. Combined science, biology. So for a nine, you needed 44 out of 70. Was that it? Yeah. You got 61. <laughs> well done. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Oh, that just is your great. She is. I know, all right. You're great. Thank you. Right, so 61 out of 70 in exam one. Ashley, I'm going to ask you one of the oh, questions no. that came oh, up no. on my biology paper one. You know, I'm not going to know this. Describe four differences. If you can get one, I'll be, I'll be pleased. But the question says, describe four Four differences between a bacterial cell and a plant cell. Well, they've got different names for one. Doesn't count. What? I don't know. You're not even Does gonna one guess? multiply and one divide itself? No. no I'm gonna guess an answer. Um, I've, uh, Joanna, I've, I don't know what they have in them that could be different anyway. What's the answer? I wrote bacterial cells do not have a nuclear. Okay. Plants do. Bacterial cells do not have chloroplasts. Plants do. Okay. Bacterial cells do not have a vacuole. Right. Plants do. And bacterial cells have smaller ribosomes. I knew nucleus, that was it. What's the nucleus? That's like the centre black bit in it, right? Yeah, what does it do? I don't know. Come on. I don't, I don't know what you wanna. I got through life on my good looks. Right. That's why I've gone nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, just a quick interlude from this GCSC science video. We have something really exciting to announce and basically exam season is upon us. 
so lots of people are going to be sitting exams at many different levels for the next two or three months and I know what it's like doing that and being in that situation and I wanted to do something basically to put a smile on everyone's face during this time but also support those who are doing their exams as absolute best I can so without further ado firstly we're going to be doing a daily upload for the whole of May and June across my main channel and my second channel it's going to be called the exam season series and we're going to be putting smiles on your face every single day throughout May and June whilst you're sitting those exams take a 10 minute study break each and every day to be able to watch a video that is coming daily for you so that's the first really exciting thing the second thing is that all of my wonderful just work products as beautifully shown right here are going to be on 20% off for the whole of May and June and will always be linked first link in the description as well as this I am bringing something a little bit extra and a little bit special to those who are sitting their exams and every single Sunday of May and June so there are eight Sundays across those two months I'm going to be doing a live study session now I'm going to ping up the different titles of all the eight study sessions that are going to be across these next two months and it's going to be a live session every Sunday on zoom it's going to be about 30 to 45 minutes long followed by as much question and answer as possible and we're going to be covering a whole range of topics to get you prepared for those exams ranging from last minute revision tips to what to do on the morning of your exam how to organize your study leave so it's going to be once a week every Sunday for the cost of 9.99 you can come on and get these incredible advice and tips from the horse's mouth me and I'm also doing a deal as well if you know that you'd like to attend all eight sessions so everything that I've just spoke about is going to be linked below let's have an incredible May and June and I am super excited to one put a smile on your face and two support you during this period of the year what did you get in your GCC yeah. science yeah. no you didn't, didn't. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Did you actually? Yeah. Give the potential difference and the frequency of the mains electricity supply in the UK. No. Can you say that again, please? Say that again. Give so it. the voltage and the frequency of the mains electricity supply in the UK. 16 volts. No. 32 volts. No. 30 volts. How are you meant to know the answers <laughs> you know to these? No. 32 hertz. No. 69 hertz. It's 230 volts and 50 hertz. Oh, yeah. What is this circuit symbol showing? Battery. I thought you did a little physics. That's not physics. It is? Yeah, well, I got See, you guys. <laughs> if you work hard at your science GCC, you will, you will know one day that become... this chemical symbol is a fuse. Oh, oh, right. If you work hard at your ask, science GCC, ask me, ask me you will then become ask me about. a successful YouTuber. You're welcome. that is paper two done and dusted chemistry one i think it was probably a little bit harder than the biology what did you think lads science really stresses me out but what would really help me with that stress is if everyone watching would subscribe so we can hit 50k thank you big lads out cool so we'll be marking that soon four papers left to go <laughs> struggling with this one sam um miss she's gonna go to the toilet do you need me to come with you, supervise you? No, thank you. Okay. You Promise wait. I'll leave my phone there recording so I won't take anything that Ellen Warren's cheating. Okay. Let's try and answer a question, shall we? <clears throat> I thought I got it. I started talking about dice. It's like, yes, Matt. <sighs> I give up. Leave it to Joanna. Cheeky little plug while Joanna's having a poo. I'm currently sitting here working on my new platform. Me and Jay are doing a 75 day challenge to get us ready and excited for the summer. So if you want to come and join, head over to my website. I'm sure she'll be nice and put the link in the bio. And you can come and join us for 75 days. Enjoy. Owen, keep going. Right, two more questions. Plus seven, plus six, plus nine, plus ten, plus nine, plus nine. Fifty-eight. Well done. Just as I imagined. So I got sixty-one in biology, fifty-eight in chemistry, mm -hmm. and fifty-three in physics. Yay! And for a nine in that chemistry paper, <gasps> you needed forty-five. Yay! Yay! Well done. Let's You're a genius. Thank you. 
is what I do for a living. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, doke, guys. So I have just marked my chemistry and biology paper two. For biology, I got 63 out of 70. Best score, yeah, out of all the papers. And it was 45 for nine. And I got 57 out of 70 on my chemistry. So I think that was similar to my chemistry paper one. Now, a couple of things. I really can't be bothered doing the last paper. Oh, <laughs> well, I will do it. Um, it is physics too. But I thought, and I was just curious to check against the grade boundaries for the whole GCSE where I was like on the grading level. So I've added together all my scores and the combination of all my scores was 290 marks, I believe. 57 plus 63, which is 120, <laughs> plus 53, which is 173, plus 61, which which is 174, 1, 2, 3, 3, 4, plus 58, 290 was my combined score. And to get a nine in these papers at GCSE Science, you needed 262. So I'm already 30 <laughs> marks above a grade nine in my GCSE. <laughs> With one paper. Without doing grade. one paper. What about if you did, I needed four, take off your so lowest I take score? Take off my lowest score, which was 51. I yeah. would be on 241. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so I would have got an eight. So the grade boundary for an eight is 226. <laughs> Wow. So yeah, there you have it. I got a nine. Um, I hope people have found this entertaining, insightful. Let me know what you thought of it in the comments and whether you'd like to see any more of these videos. This is day one of two whole months of daily vlogs. So be excited, be prepared. I cannot wait for the next two months to keep putting a smile on people's face and to bring them as much support as possible. Well, if you want to get nine awesome. like you, they should come and yeah, study with you, shouldn't exactly. they, really? They should. You've and proved your point that you're good at your job. Yeah. <laughs> thanks, Sam. <laughs> um, and how to do that will always be linked in the description. So thanks for watching. Remember to like and subscribe if you aren't already. We'll see you in the next video tomorrow or on the second channel. How excited. Keep smashing it and remember anything is possible if you just like. Bye, guys. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. You're not expecting that. No. <laughs> that was such a f***ing dad joke. <laughs>